Songstress of the Enemy Forces Part 1. Okay, I think I lied. <sighs> we got more gun than seed stuff. <laughs> God damn it. That's Kiriyamato. I've been a good friend of yours. Oh, goddamn Raul Crest. Take off that ridiculous white mask. You're no char. Oh my, I have the right to judge humanity. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> oh boy, it's Lacus. <laughs> and we see Hara. Who's a running theme in the Gundam series? Start when Amro created one. And it's continued in some of them ever since. Some of them, not all of them. You'll always find Haro. He's in Seed, though, and Double O, and, and Original. And UC, of course, all of UC. Most of UC. <sighs> and we find out Lacus is basically a, a princess as well. A Zaft princess. So we're kind of holding her hostage. Ugh. <sighs> Using her to bait them, so we can get out of this alive. Pretty cowardly for the good guys, don't you think? Eh? That's what the thing I don't like about Seed. <laughs> Commander Bright had more morals. Who's a boss like that? Okay, this revenge fucker. Uh, where's a Radom or something? I love to see the Radom coming here. The fuck this shit. There's no way we can arrive. They killed all those friends of ours. Stupid naturals. Oh, oh boy. Oh, God, how many Gundam Seed missions do I have to throw down our throat? I miss us to Lancer and everyone else. <laughs> oh, it'll be over soon. It'll be over soon, folks. I'm getting sick of it. All I mean is now we did. Well, this will get us a little score of the Gundams. I guess. But obviously since there's a part one, there's gotta be part two. <sighs> but if any luck we can set up for an epic map attack again. That will make this fun. I enjoyed that. The Desco is not supposed to be that beastly man. <laughs> but Super World Wars J, almost anything can work. If you try it hard enough. Well, except in the Desco units, I don't think they're really that great. Once you upgrade them. Because, uh, because the events of the, the movie, Prince of Darkness, are averted in this game, you don't get the upgrades for them, I don't think. Quote me on that, on that, but I'm pretty sure it's the case. Yeah, uh, the Nadesco movie's fucking weird. Because the series was a comedy, right? What, hair romantics? The movie t makes everything serious and dark and brooding. And it just really doesn't fit, it doesn't make sense. It's a total 180. It's bad when shows do that. Like, straight from the roots like that. Ah, uh, wait. Oh shit! <laughs> oh, that could be bad. Can't get game over here. First time. <laughs> ah, that'd be hilarious. Then I would have no credibility in the the world of strategy games. Oh my god, that's a lot of guys. Holy <laughs> shit! You guys are just begging for a map attack there, man. If only I was hanging around there, man. Mazinger? Mazinger. Mm, Mazinger's scared. <laughs> Edgy and Calvinican. Kinda messed him up, though. What about our sniper? Are you in position? Yeah. Bully. We'll Alright, here we go. Let the bullshit commence.
I wish the aliens would come in, come in here in the middle of a hostage situation. Like, give us the girl. And all of a sudden, he got the rad am shooting their tentacles at the zaft assholes. <laughs> but no, I don't think that happens. Sure, would be nice if it did. You guys, so silly. Getting shot down for no reason. Except for the fact we're naturals and you're coordinators. That's another thing I liked about Seed Better. It was more of space noise versus earthlings than manufactured people. Versus naturals. It was more compelling, more relatable. Like more understandable if these people are different. Like have different beliefs. Like, you know, the Earthlings might think you kind of sold out by moving to space. And the people in space might think the people on Earth, like, bastardized the planet or let it fall into ruin. Or that their souls are weighed down by gravity. <laughs> uh, Desco, I wish you could do your map right on now. Wait, maybe we should... Why should I wish? I should get a position for it. I see the second wave incoming. This is dangerous, and I did not advise it, but... <laughs> it's certainly a hell of a lot of fun. Psh, level 10! <laughs> God damn it. I almost making Calvina jealous. <laughs> Kido sitting there at level 4. <laughs> it's gonna be fucking pissed. So where's my experience, guys? Yeah, I totally don't want to use him, so yeah. <laughs> Not gonna lie. But, we'll worry about that more once we get a bigger team. Once we got, like, say, G Gun and the Brain Powered guys. Another. Another certain unit related to Combat War V. Its brother unit, you could say. Things like that. Or what I'd rather use. The super robots are pretty damn good in this game. As you've seen. With Combat War V and Mossinger. Mossinger tanking, Combat War just destroying things. Well, Calvinus unit is boss. But of course, the originals usually have to be. Because you don't want a weak ass original, you'd be shackled down for a weak unit for so many chapters. Wow, they can't hit him with shit. It's amazing. get it. Yeah, I knew it. I can believe in you, my friend. What do you guys say, AG? Just here it comes. Ah, that's stupid. That's an impractical pattern. How am I gonna how am I gonna set that up? We try. They have guard or something. Wow, they have lots of loud guys. That's a big ass crew. I'll try it. Why the hell not? Tactical errors, ho! Hmm, may I give Calvina some love? Why not? Make her more of a beast. Too slow. Damn. I can't expect you to take him out though, Calvina. Maybe we'll throw Keto a bone. There, Keto, we get some glory. What do you have to say for yourself? Here I go. Saying to my glows of awesome power? This burning grip tells me to defeat you? If only. Training with Master Age will make a man out of you. <laughs> we'll deal with that later. Hmm, <laughs> everyone probably better stand back. Man, I should have moved Blue Earth so forward. Oh. <laughs> Strike, I don't care for you. 
But obviously there's gonna be more to this stage, something tells me. Reinforcements. Something, some kind of twist. Uh, you got good range, buddy. I'm jealous, not gonna lie. I know that's gonna hurt. Armor or not, it's gonna hurt. Wait, who's covering? Mazinger's covering? Then do it. Oh, Blue Earth. So, probably worth it. Wow, we're low on energy. Oh, I better probably save that energy. I better refill that energy better yet. And here comes the gun. What do you gotta say for yourself, Gundam? You see, not gonna say anything to us. I'm gonna blow you apart, leg ship. <laughs> he's no Gastero. He's a little crazy, but he's no Gastero. He's not gonna call us monkeys. <laughs> I don't know what... I'm intimately familiar with the G series weak points. <laughs> Apparently not, lady. Oh god, this is bad. Just evade. I have to finish this quick and save the advance party. Damn, you got some real spirit. There's no way you're gonna get past me, though. She's attacking me. It's more fun if they try to resist. You guys wish you were Gostero. I wonder what he thinks about this. I mean, we're all, probably all just monkeys to him, whether we're made in a test tube or more from a woman. <laughs> well, I always fail. But he's got hidden away, so he doesn't give a fuck. Well, let me guess. Oh, hey, we can hit like three guys. Well, it's a start. Luck. Do we have strike? Oh, man, we have no guarantee we'll hit him. So, that will help a little. Anything else we can do to boost power? Oh, let's just hope this goes well. 100% chance to hit. Okay, same old story. We saw this before. Okay, pay no attention to that dialogue. Stuff about the dance party really doesn't affect anything, apparently. Alright, Gundam. Calvina could provide us, provide us with support to take out the Gundam, possibly. Let's find out. Can you do it, Kira? I've got a G2. Okay, stop saying that, it's a Gundam! How lazy are you? It's a Gundam, bro. That's strike, but who's the pilot? It's more fun if you try to resist. I thought they didn't want this war. It was just because of that bloody Valentine massacred them. Why are they... Uh... That's where I want to pop the scene. It's like, hey guys. Let's... They just committed a massacre on us. Let's go to war and commit a massacre on them. Oh wow, she says something regarding Kira. Hmm, interesting. Just die. <laughs> Fade into the cleavage. <laughs> Let it consume you. Shh, gotta punch out. Got punched out, bitch. <laughs> you hauled ass out of there. Eh, still got the psychopath on our ass. But he's not so scary. Pretty predictable. <laughs> I would love to hit him with that, but that's not gonna work. Womp womp. Times like this. <laughs> I 
Ah, yes! <laughs> Worth it. <laughs> That'd be funny to troll him. I will do it. What's up? <laughs> Blow him to pieces. If I don't care about your face shift armor, I mean, I do. That is kind of irritating. Rust Hurricane, I'll blow on you. Ah! I'll blow on you, but it won't even hit. What about rockets? Rocket punching. What if he says anything to Mazinger? Let's find out. It's your Mazinger coming up, buddy. Alright, cut it. Uh, wow, our odds are not great. Rest fire? Wow, even less chance of hitting him. Ah, that's all this pretty discouraging stuff. Oh, nothing no special dialogue between the two. This'll be payback. Good fun! Oh, wow. <laughs> How the hell did I end up with this much damage? Because <laughs> you dirt. Hmm... That armor is annoying. I might want to... He might retreat. Regardless of what we do here. First, let's do this. Don't get hit. 9% chance. I think we can get him. Just have to be very careful about it. Very sure of ourselves. Oh wait, uh, the armor's falling.